around the age of 13, I kind of noticed a change in my mother. And well, maybe it was about 11 when I noticed the change and 13 when it began to affect my life. My mother became a alcoholic. I was at a friend's house near my school, which was about 20, maybe 15, 20 miles from our home. Um, my mom went to a happy hour after work that day and I went to a friend's house. So um, once my mom was finished, my friend's mom dropped me off to the restaurant where she was located. And when I got to her, she was so drunk, she couldn't drive. Um, I had never driven before. I was scared. I was only 15. Uh, I didn't have a license and we were about 20 minutes from my house. And of course it would require us to get on the highway. It was raining um, and at first I actually let her start driving us home and I think it was once we hit the median in the middle of the street and she just completely ran over it. I just kept screaming at the top of my lungs to stop the car and pull over and um, at that point I got behind the wheel and I cried and cried and prayed and prayed and um, actually drove us home. Uh, thank God we made it safely. It was almost like she didn't want to be helped. I went to her house and um, the door was unlocked and I was able to go in and I saw her sitting in a chair and she couldn't move. Um, her skin was completely yellow, her eyes were yellow. And every time I would go visit my mom, I would say, mom, please let me get you some help. Please let me take you to the hospital. And she always said, no, no, no. But this particular day, she couldn't walk, she could barely talk, she couldn't move. Um, her stomach was um, enlarged. She was very, very ill. And when I asked her that last time, um, did she want some help or let me help her? She finally said yes. Had I not gone that day, she probably wouldn't have made it through the night. 